What's up, everybody? It's Infinite World, and I'm back with another reaction. And today, unfortunately, I'm reacting to the Eagles getting eliminated by the playoffs. I already have a video up about it. It's a short. You can check that out. But I want to watch the highlights because I feel like I got some things I got to say about this game. You know what I'm saying? And I can't put it in a short. So I got some things I got to say about this game, man. And I'm going to talk about it right now. Really, I never watch highlights on games that we lose because it's just, you know what I'm saying? Today we're going to do it, man, because there's a lot of things that got to be said about this game. In the offensive line has been the two bookends there at tackle. They do tend to leak pressure in the middle. Here's one caught by Otten. Middle of the field, always open, of course. Play action from Baker. That's Evans. See what I'm saying? Middle of the field. When you, go, when you play the Eagles, go to the middle of the field. We can do whatever you want, actually. Look, run the ball, middle of the field, bomb it. Because we can't tackle. See what I'm saying? For a normal team, that's a four-yard loss, and you stop them. No touchdowns in that game. This one is incomplete for the rookie trade ball. But why is my man on the floor? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's just... Let me chill, man. From 28. And the Buccaneers get the first points of the night. And that he did do. And we saw him last year. Here is a handoff to Swift. Same play. If they run the ball, it's that. They don't do single back, no eye form. Third and two, bomb the ball. Hold on, man. Hold on, man. Because that, that, that don't sit right with me, bro. That's bad coaching right there. That's terrible coaching. Third and two, you got a good running back. Yeah, they bomb the ball. Yo, it was so bad yesterday, bro. I started laughing, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. I started laughing. I, I wasn't even mad. Like, wide open. They play zone. They don't play man. They never play man. So it's like they don't play man to man coverage. Yeah, and I remember. I remember thinking when I saw that he dropped that, but we're in for a long night. The second I seen how open he was, we're in for a long night. Wide open. Yeah, they're going to tackle him, though. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> nope. No flags. No flags. No tackles made. Dropping balls. But that's when it all kind of changed, and I thought it was an overreaction after a couple of losses. And it is look at this! Look at this! He just ran 15 yards behind the line of scrimmage. Yeah, you know it's bad when our highlights are drop passes. Like that's our highlights. They're getting all kind of run plays. I seen one play of us, uh, half back, half back sweep, drop pass. That's our highlights. With tacklers in his way, picks up nine. The Fletcher Coxes, Jordan Davises, and Jalen Carter—they got to be a factor. Here's a pass over the middle, caught Otten again. Another big play for the Buccaneers. Would be a 54-yard field goal try from this spot. Mayfield is almost intercepted. See, a winning team would have picked that off right there. But obviously, we're not that. Who absolutely drills it. I think that what we had told, we had been told coming in, they were going to run it behind that line, and they have it. Here's a completion to Smith. Yeah, yeah Smith, the only one who showed up on our offense. For the first time, the Eagles are in Buccaneer territory. Boy, did they need that. 31 yards to Devontae Smith. On first down, another completion. Again, it's Smith breaking tackles. What a good run after the catch. They better make sure they keep that, man. If they don't keep him, I'm not a fan of the Eagles no more. And I've been a fan my whole life. They're coming. Incomplete. Smith to 
target and Jamel Dean in cover. Now hold on. They're coming. This is what I want to know. Third and seven. Why are your plays designed before the third down before the first down marker? Like, look, they got my man right here wide all the way open behind the line of scrimmage. So if he throws it to him, they're gonna tackle him before and we're not gonna get the first down anyway. Like he's he's right here wide open. I don't understand. Everybody else is covered. What are these plays? Terrible play calling. What are these plays that they're calling? I lost my voice a little bit just from yelling yesterday, being angry at the game. Dang. Nobody could catch up, and Mayfield says first down. Baker Mayfield got money on us, bro. That's how you know. That's how you know you got to make changes. Look, 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 they fall for more yards than our offense can get. He just tripped and gained more yards than our whole team. I'm sure they're going to tackle him. Like... For the first time in five weeks. Here's a pitch to White. He's got it. First down, Buccaneers. Buccaneers are inside field goal range for McLaughlin. This one is tipped. Play was made by Cunningham. They were trying to give us that game, bro, and we just said, no, nah, we don't want it. Yeah, you have it. Snap a bit. High kick is perfect. 15 or more yards downfield. Remember playing with that dislocated middle finger. Here's a double move, and there's Julio Jones with a big play. And I, was, and I thought Julio was going to go off when I seen that. First down. But I think he just got hurt, and I don't even know if he played again after that. Making the sweep. Good protection this time. Aired out. That's what I'm saying. Look, that ball was right on the money. You know what I'm saying? People were saying Hurts sucks. Hurts is trash. Hurts is making the throws. He's still fast. He still cut and does the jukes. He's still himself. He's just making bad decisions. Like, you know what I'm saying? But it's really that play calling. Like, what is he supposed to do on that third and seven that they just had? And all his receivers are before the line of scrimmage. And the ones who aren't are covered because you didn't scheme any plays to get them open. What is he supposed to do? For Devontae Smith. Hurts keeps wide open. A walk in touchdown for Goddard. And some life for the Philadelphia Eagles. Great job by Devontae Smith. Outstanding throw by Hurts. And they finish it off with a touchdown to Goddard. Well, that's going to be a flag as the Buccaneers came across Zion McCollum. Now they may go for two. Yeah. And I remember really thinking we were going to come back at this time. <laughs> Now, do you see that face mask? Now, do you see that face mask? Look at him. He's yanked his whole mask. But why are you doing that play in this instance? You have one timeout, one minute left before the half, you do a screen. And stay in bounds at that. You gotta hit the sidelines, bro. Right. Now let's see what Nick Sirianni, Johnson. Let's see what they. Let's see what these guys got. You know what I'm saying? Let's see what play they're gonna call. 22 seconds left. No timeouts, and it's third and eight. I'm sure they're gonna go for the sidelines. You know what I'm saying? Oh, 
Watkins, long way to go, and he won't get there. Brought down by Levante David. Now, do you see what I'm saying when I blame the, the coaching, the coordinating? Clock continues to no, run. Not even get in. Neither team showing any desire to stop it. Pressure off the edge from Diaby. Hurts is set. Brought down by Cansey. When they brought the pressures with the ball having to come out quickly, the Eagles just haven't been able to make Tampa pay. It comes out quick here for Otten. And down goes Mayfield. See, now they're not even showing you all the plays that Tampa dropped. They showed you our drop. They ain't showing you all the Tampa's drops. Tampa should have been blowing us out had they not dropped the ball ten times. Rashad White cuts back and has a first down plus. Delivers the hit. Station has shown great leadership on both sides of the ball. He's in trouble here and set. There's Williams again. Gainwell, and there's not much there, so he'll try the other side. Levante David brings him down inside the five. So now third and six. Hurts. David at his feet. But why is he trying to make that play like that, bro? Just take the sack. No, I'm sorry. I just throw the ball away. Look, throw it away right there. He kept the ball. But what play did they run again? What are these plays? See if he was down. Anthony Nelson was on his back. Is this a safety? What are these plays, man? Where's Devon? Where's I'm sorry. Where's DeAndre Swift? They don't even give him the ball. One of the best running backs in the league. Game. Now Baker Mayfield is not trash by no means. See what happens when you give Swift the ball? But anyways, look, Baker Mayfield is not trash by no means. So there's no reason why, like I'm not saying he sucks, right? So like Baker Mayfield's not a bum, but there's no reason you should make him look like Peyton Manning. You know what I'm saying? He looked like Brian Peyton Manning out there, bro. Like you know what I'm saying? No, like. If you told me, like, look at them, they got, they're nine and eight. We had more wins than they finished with. They finished with nine wins. We had more wins than them week 10, week nine. Like, you know what I'm saying? And you lose to them in the playoffs. We had 10 wins. What was it, week 11, week 10? We got, yeah, we had a bye week, so week 11. We had more wins than they finished with week 11, bro. Like, think about that. And they knocked us out the playoffs. And they've gotten after Hurts in the pass rush. Here's one downfield for Smith. And a first down inside the 40. And some light for the Eagles in the end. If I was DeAndre Swift, I'd leave, bro. As Devontae Smith gets 20. I'm sorry, I keep saying Devontae Smith. If I was DeAndre Swift, I would leave, bro. This year. Nobody wants to admit to it, but this was not a team expected to do anything. This is a catch. Because they don't use him. A thousand yards and he gets 12, 10 attempts a game. Man. And that's on a good night. Fourth and five. All you need is a first down. Let's see what they do. Pressure on Hurts to the end zone. Incomplete. And a turnover on down. Why not just get the first down? With Davis in coverage on Smith. No, I want a touchdown. Bro, you can't even get five yards. You want a touchdown. Mayfield over the middle. That pass is caught by Payne Durham. Look, he dragged him for 10 yards. Like, this game is just so frustrating, man. Like, if they lose this, I'm able to get the 12 wins. Here's a completion fit in there to Otten for a first down. And, but this is his 14th year, and what a career he has had. This might be his swan song. First and 20, here's a beautiful throw and catch. The back shoulder for Evans to start a career in NFL record. Had 1,255. First down carry, and an easy one of that for Rashad White. 
years was just short of winning the Super Bowl a year ago could potentially lose his job, but Jeff Lurie has shown. Rashad White, we, we turned that boy into Marshall Falk. <laughs> we turned that boy into Barry Sanders. They don't give him the ball, though. Swift wide open. For a first down. But I think I look for a 50-yard bomb instead. Yo, fourth and 12. Let's go. Let's throw it for the sidelines. <laughs> Outside the marker. Like, yo. I can't believe what I see, man. Jason Kelsey. That's not it for Baker Mayfield and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. What a night tonight for Tampa Bay in a 32 to 9 win. Yeah, I knew it's time for Kelsey to go. Uh, get these bums off my screen, bro. I don't even want to talk about these guys, man. But what I do want to talk about is the fact that you had third and two and you bombed the ball. For some reason, instead of getting the first down, you had fourth and five, and you went for a touchdown. You didn't go for the first down. Um, you went for it on fourth. No, you went for a two-point conversion. You could have kicked the ball. Um, every third down play, our receivers are before the, the first down marker. So when they catch it, they're just, we don't get the first down. You had fourth and 12. You threw it for an out-of-bounds sideline catch before the first down marker. He called it out-of-bounds. Hertz is still making good throws, making good plays. He's just also making terrible decisions. Offensive coordinator got to go. He's the main one who has to go. Um, Sirianni, man, he got to go too. Sirianni got to go, bro, because at the end of the day, every time I say something about Sirianni, here's what I hear back. Oh, well, that's not his job. Play calling, that's not his job. Make sure DeAndre Swift gets the ball. That's not his job. Why are they in an the empty set? He should be making sure they're not in an the empty set on third and short because then they know we're throwing it. That's not his job. <laughs> Teaches players how to tackle. That's not his job. Like, so what does Sirianni do? What's his job? Nothing that nothing that comes with the NFL is his job, according to everybody else. So what does he do? Just stand there with a piece of paper and pretend he's reading and scratch, scratch his head and go, this is what he does constantly. <laughs> like, that's his job, bro? I could do that. Sign me up. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, he got to go. Because let's say, let's say the bad play calling isn't him. A good coach is going to make sure you don't run that play. Like, anybody with a brain could should tell that offensive coordinator if he's the one who calls the play, dude, why are you doing a designed bomb? Throw it 30 yards, designed for that on third and two. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is, man. Next year is a new year. I think they have to rebuild. I'm not even, I'm not expecting nothing big next year. But if they do, they do. If they don't, they don't. You know, I'm just very disappointed in what I saw. That's all, and, you know, because we went from 10-1 and 1 to just scrubs. We didn't even look like we deserved to be in the playoffs. We were literally out of everybody. I think we scored the least amount of points in the playoffs so far. You know what I'm saying? And you got people playing with backups. But I don't know. It's just me. Like and subscribe.